right, guys, we're gonna start making our superstar foldable today. So the very first thing you're going to need is a manila envelope. It's gonna have that bratted pocket. And then we're gonna go ahead and put our pages in order. Like I feel like they would go in your books just so it'd be easier to go through and put them all together. So your bratted folder looks like this. Your, um, this is gonna be your right-hand side and your left-hand side, you know, should be folded kind of like a book. You may have to push it down a little bit, okay? So let's go through the order of your papers so you can set them in the correct order. And we can go through this. Um, I started the video earlier and I didn't push record, but your first page is gonna be this page right here, the seventh grade superstar. In some classes it's blue, in some classes it's other colors, so just make sure you're looking for that. That's your first page. The second page you're looking for is gonna be this All About Integers page. Okay, and I'm gonna flip it down. We're gonna be looking for this piece next, the number system. And guys, you can stop this video at any time, catch up, find what you need, then get back in line, okay? The next piece I want you looking for is adding decimals, subtracting decimals, and on the back side, it says um, adding fractions and subtracting fractions, so that's gonna be your next piece. Okay, the next piece I want you looking for is um, solving equations, okay? And on the back side, it says solving equations and inequalities, like that, okay? The next piece I'd like you to look for is um, constant of proportionality, okay? And then the next piece I want you looking for is proportions and examples. Okay, and these might, they're all classes are kind of different colors. I just kind of did what we could do in terms of amount of paper. Um, okay, our next page that we're looking for is similar figures and examples. Then we're looking for um, probability. Probability, and then on this side it has some probability questions. Then the next page is simple interest. And then we should have three sheets of just different shapes. And then our last page should be this. Okay. Um, so that's going to be the order that we're going through these and gluing these in. Make sure you kind of stay with me. Please stop the video at any time that you feel like you need to or so that you can catch up and make sure that you're doing it correctly. That's, that's the priority is just to get this done correctly and glued in correctly. Okay. So, um... I went ahead and I had already glued this on. Um, one of the kids' teachers said a dot is a lot, so I did six dots on this paper in particular, okay? And um, that worked out pretty good. I need to add a little bit more, but too much makes it um, not do as well, so I need that kind of done, okay? So I was trying to scoot it out so maybe we could see a little bit more, but not having so much luck to do that. So we'll just kind of go from here. Okay, so this is on our outside page. Okay, so this is, and then on our, flipping on our inside, first inside page, we're gonna start with the base, but the very back part is going to be this, all about integers part, okay? So go ahead and flip that over. Mine has two-sided because I did a couple of them wrong. And go ahead and do your dots for, okay. And then get that down on your paper. Now I'm gonna stick it a little bit closer to the inside because I'm gonna put something on the outside of it here in just a minute. So I left some more room over here, okay. And then your next piece is this little um, number system and you're going to fold right here on the dark line okay see that dark line right there we're gonna fold on that dark line and then we're going to I'm gonna put a little bit of glue right here on this dark line okay and I'm gonna do that above my not all about integers right in there, okay? So I put a little bit too much because we really don't want it 
sticking right there. And then my last thing is going to be this decimals page, which mine happens to be white. I don't know what color yours is, okay? And so we're going to, this part right here is a folding line, okay? So this part right here, I'm sorry, hit that. It, we're gonna fold that little first dotted line. We're gonna fold down, okay? And then, gotta make sure this one's sticking down. Okay, and then I'm going to do the same thing with this edge. We're gonna glue it down. Okay, right there. So that it goes along the edge over here. So when you open it up, you can see all of this in there. So I kind of put it this closer to the left hand edge and then I'm gonna fold this on that second dotted line. Okay, so then when you have it, you can open this up. It talks about fractions. This is about decimals. You have the number system inside and then all about integers underneath. So we have all those things on your left hand side of your paper. Okay, your um, second page is this inequalities page. Okay, so how you do that, you're going to first fold it in half and it's gonna have this on the front side. Okay, so can you see that? And then you're going to fold it where this is still on the top. Okay, hold on, let me, let me look at this again. Okay, so this is the top. Ooh, okay, we need to fold it half first. So I need to fold it in half up first. Excuse me, I was wrong. Okay, so in half up first. So right here, fold it up like this, covering that. And then fold it over. So this is on the top. So it should open this way and then down. Okay, so on the front it should be solving equations and inequalities. On the back it should say glue to top of section two. We're considering this section two. So we're gonna go, and it's the inside page of the first one. So we're gonna put our dots, okay? And then I'm gonna glue this to the top of the section two. Okay. So we should be starting to stick a little bit on some of these other ones. Our next one is going to be the bottom of section two and it's constant proportionality and graphing. So remember what we did a while ago, see how it has that on the back. So we're gonna fold the bottom up to the top. Okay, and then we're gonna go right to left. So this is what it opens and then folds down. The back side says glue to bottom of section two. So we have Okay. And then we are already done with section two. Thank you. Okay. So section one or to section two top, section two bottom, okay? So go ahead and turn to the next page, okay? So now we should be on the bracketed side, but we're on the left-hand side of the page, okay? There's two pieces in here, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to do them, and then um, we're going to, okay, so these, this proportion and examples and then um, similar figures and examples. Okay, so you're gonna need both of these. We're gonna go ahead and cut off this section right here. We don't need it. Okay, so same thing on proportions and examples. We're gonna go ahead and cut off this piece right here. Okay, because we don't need it either. And then, 
we're going to fold them on the dotted line. Okay, so this first fold is going to take place here. Now it says glue to section three in book. This one also says glue to section three in book, but they're going to be layered on top of each other. Okay, so you're going to layer these on top of each other. So if you put them together, okay, um, this proportions and examples is going to go on top, and that other one should just be seen underneath. Okay, so um, right the very first step is we're going to glue this blue or your we're going to put glue on the back of similar figures and examples okay and we're going to glue that into um the proportions and examples so it kind of opens up like a little book there okay and then get that down okay and then I'm going to stop the video right here and then I'm going to finish up in the next video.